in just a few days. You might want to take a glance at the sky. Look up, slow down. More than 100 hot air balloons will be up in the sky for the National Balloon Classic. Now we are so excited because we want to take you inside the inner workings of the classic and how these incredible pilots get their uh, balloons ready in the morning. So some of the hot air balloon pilots are getting ready for a test flight. Local 5's Khalil Maycock joins us live from Waterworks Park where they'll be taking off from this morning. So Khalil, tell us more about what is happening. Good morning, Sabrina. Like you said, I'm out here at Waterworks Park and lots of people, the, the people who are going to be flying are actually setting up right now. And right now I'm joined with one of the pilots who is going to be going up in the air in just a few minutes, Mr. Randy. So good morning. How are you? I'm good. Thanks. So talk to me about what is the National Balloon Classic? Well, it's a national event that's classic for balloons, is what it is. No, but there's about 100 balloons that will show up, and we'll be flying the entire coming week. So that's the, uh, what, third, July 30th through August 8th or 7th. And we'll go up every morning and every evening, of course, all depending on the weather. We need winds that are under 10 miles an hour. But uh, we'll take off there at the uh, National Balloon Classic Field in Indianola. And it's just, it's a great family event. You see a lot of balloons, a lot of people, and it's a good time. And then, so if I'm coming out here, what can I expect to see? Well, what you need to do to come out is this year we need to buy tickets online. So that's something new this year. If you've come out other years, this is a big change. So if you go to our website, nationalballoonclassic.com, you can get your tickets there online. And that's kind of one of the new things because of, of course, the COVID protocol. Gotcha. Now I want to walk a little closer to okay. the balloon basket. So if I am coming out here and I don't know anything about, you know, hot air balloons, can you talk to me, Theo, can you come a bit closer to this mm -hmm. basket? So can sure. you show me some of the parts of what this is? Absolutely. There's different kinds of baskets, but uh, this particular one is a three sided wicker basket. And what it has is in this one, three propane tanks, uh, about you know, bigger than your grill propane, of course, because we use about 30 gallons of propane. And the, the propane then runs up to the burner up here. And I'm not sure if you can see that, but the, the burner will put out millions upon millions of BTU. So it's really super hot to heat up the envelope. Now, we're just getting going, so we don't have the envelope out here, but the envelope is what everybody sees, of course. That's the fabric part. But all you have to do is you fill the envelope up with cold air, then you turn on your burner and get it heated up, and that's what makes it go up. Gotcha. All right, so there you have it. Those are some of the logistics of a hot air balloon basket. Remember, if you want to come out to that, you have to buy your tickets online, nationalballoonclassic.com. So live in Des Moines, Khalil Maycock, Local 5 News, we are Iowa. I'm so excited, Khalil. You'll be out there all morning, and while you won't be actually going up in a hot air balloon, you'll be able to see all of the different steps that they take to get prepped before taking off for flight, including that I'm, I'm ready for that shh, and I'm sure we're going to be seeing that in our next hit, so stay okay. tuned. Wonderful, Khalil. Thank you so much. Another